Nbeongbo gets two years in jail and five years of probation. After taking plea deal. 20, let me, it's 12 months in a year, 20, 20. So according to my calculation, what he gonna do? Two years in jail and five years of probation. Okay, so let me guess. So he gonna get out in 2026 or 2027. Do like a year or two of probation and then the probation will get terminated, right? I ain't gonna lie. I guess Drew Finlan kinda, and I guess he kinda this, I guess. I mean, to be the best lawyer in the world, I'm paying a nigga 300K and young boy pay him down that million because he got another gun charge. So, I ain't gonna lie, I think Drew Finley kind of dropped the ball on this one. Because you got all Boosie cases gone. You got all, Boosie's a whole free man. Boosie got no record. Boosie got a clean slate. Kids is way less than Boosie. But I mean, you know what they say when, when you the guy, you know what I'm saying? When you the guy that year, you the guy. So, hey. But shit, two years, that's still a long time. I was just telling my homeboy this other day, I don't see a lot of people getting out of jail and keeping that same. I think young boy might be on some Gucci man shit when he got out or something. Like, he might just be, he might just be over with. Like, that was a nice little era, man. But like I said, that's that karma. Y'all know that karma. karma. I told y'all that karma. Hey, I told y'all what's karma. Look at him and his boy. I told y'all. See, if he would have just been like oh man you know wow that yeah whatever just making his little songs cool but he did way more than that he did way like man like, like i told you i said that the karma gonna come around it's gonna and look because you know what the crazy thing is the other person i'm not gonna say his name but the other person he was doing way more than this he was doing way come on man and he never really went to jail like that. Like that, you gotta give him his props. Like, shh, but hey, NBA young boy, two years. I guess we'll see him in what twenty twenty six, twenty twenty seven. Damn, the twenty twenty eight. He gonna be back where he started anyway. He's on house arrest again. He sold the Utah house. Janiah, uh fiance, played for the New Orleans Pelicans now. And he already say he don't like Janiah, the baby, uh, the husband taking pictures with his son. That's just he finna be back. They finna. I, I'm trying to see how that's gonna work out. Something gonna happen. Uh, what was his name? Dejounte Murray. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know, bro. This is gonna be crazy. But I mean, I wonder if they considered all that. Let me give it. But yeah, you like, comment, subscribe. Hey. Your rep to house TV, that's what they're saying. Like, they usually right though. So, but hey, something to take out of this. You know, all this started in 2018. All this JD Young and Julio Fulio, Young Boy, Young and Ace, Lil Dirk, all this started in 2018. It's safe to say that Young and Ace and Lil Dirk is the only two goats out of these situations because everybody else, Young Thug. Everybody else, they didn't. It's only two people that got out of all this. Lil Durk and, and Young and Ace, man. So shout out to them boys, because they canceling Young and Ace shows. He can't even do a They canceled his Daytona. I don't know what the hell in Daytona for Young and Ace, but uh, <laughs> they canceled his Daytona show. They canceled his Tampa show. Man, but them the goats, so. Y'all don't try this at home.